the first half of the new energy vehicle race saw China utilize lithium batteries to surpass European engine dominance. Now, the second half of the competition centers on all solid state batteries, a technology that represents the final frontier for traditional automotive giants. For two decades, major players like Toyota and Panasonic invested heavily in this field, filing over 1,300 core patents to create a protective wall. Their strategy was to bypass current liquid battery technology and wait at the finish line, expecting to collect licensing fees from any competitor wanting to achieve 1,200 kilometers of range and 10-minute charging speeds. However, the landscape changed this year as the Chinese industry moved to dismantle this monopoly through a strategy of changing lanes to overtake. While competitors focused on a single technological path and laboratories, Chinese firms adopted a dual approach, commercializing semi-solid-state batteries for immediate market use while pursuing all-solid-state research through a massive national coordination platform. Backed by 6 billion yuan in research funds and a complete industrial supply chain, this movement treats the challenge as a systemic battle rather than a purely academic one. The transition to solid-state technology is driven by the fundamental limitations of liquid electrolytes which are flammable and limit energy density. By replacing liquid with solid electrolytes, batteries become virtually fireproof and can achieve energy densities exceeding 500 watt-hours per kilogram. This shift renders the traditional advantages of internal combustion engines, such as quick refueling and long-range, obsolete. This technological iteration is expected to cause a massive earthquake in the existing supply chain. As solid-state electrolytes replace liquid ones and metallic lithium replaces graphite anodes, $3 trillion material sectors are emerging. Solid electrolytes, advanced lithium metal processing, and high-performance conductive agents like carbon nanotubes. While older giants focused on separators and liquid electrolytes may face decline, new leaders are rising by securing the raw materials and processing techniques required for this solid-state future. China's control over critical minerals like zirconium and lanthanum further strengthens its position, transforming what was once a Japanese technological fortress into a new era of Chinese industrial leadership.